Thank you. Good afternoon. Mr. Thomas, Mr. Rogers. Pull the curtains aside. He is English. He is 21 years of age. His name is John Merrick. Gentlemen, in the course of my profession, I have come upon many lamentable deformities of the face due to injury or disease, as well as mutilations and contortions of the body, depending upon like causes. But at no time have I met with such a perverted or degraded version of a human being as this man. Now, I wish to draw your attention to the insidious conditions affecting this patient. Can you see over there? Note, if you will, the extreme enlargement of the skull, the right upper limb, which is totally useless, the alarming curvature of the spine. Uh, would you turn around, please? Turn around, please. The looseness of the skin and the varying fibrous tumors that cover 90% of the body. And there is every indication that these afflictions have been in existence and have progressed rapidly since birth. The patient also suffers from chronic bronchitis. As an interesting side note, in spite of the aforementioned anomalies, the patient's genitals remain entirely intact and unaffected. Thank you. And his left arm is perfectly normal, as you see. So, then, gentlemen, owing to this series of conditions, the congenital exostosis of the skull, extensive papillomatous growth, large pendulous masses in connection with the skin, the great enlargement of the right upper limb involving all the bones, the massive distortion of the head, and the extensive area covered by papillomatous growth, the patient has been called the elephant man. Thank you.